Well, they won't be talking baseball outside of Bush Stadium this morning. Instead, they're focusing on back to school with thousands of backpacks and other supplies going out to teachers. Yeah, let's go check in with Fox 2's Chris Renier. He's joining us from downtown St. Louis to explain. Good morning, Chris. Hey, John, good morning to you. Blair, good morning to you as well. We are on Clark Street, basically right between Bush Stadium and Ballpark Village, and this is a great effort going on down here this morning. Take a look behind me. You have all these boxes filled with backpacks and those backpacks have school supplies in them for kids to help them succeed in school. These backpacks are still being unloaded here this morning from this gentleman coming off a Coca-Cola truck, one of the sponsors here. And then farther down Clark Street, there are other stations where we are unloading other boxes filled with school supplies as well. This is all put on by KidSmart. It's a St. Louis based nonprofit focused on helping kids in need succeed in school by giving them free essential learning tools. Let's bring in Bill Adams. He is on the board of KidSmart, former chairman of the board. Bill, thank you very much for joining us. Thanks for being here. Absolutely. Thank you for what you do. Kind of explain what's going to be going on here this morning because this is going to turn into one big like conveyor line here in a little while. What's happening? Yeah, absolutely. So Bush Stadium and the Cardinals Closed down Clark Street this morning to help us host this special event. Teachers will be driving down Clark Street. Each one of them will have a little packard on their car telling us what grade they teach, what school they're from. And by that, we'll know what supplies get loaded up in their trunk, and it'll just be a conveyor line. They'll just keep on coming. Over a million dollars worth of free school supplies will be distributed this morning, Chris. That is fantastic. What is in the backpacks and in the boxes we're seeing out here? So it's all the basic school supplies that kids need to succeed in school, as you mentioned earlier. So there's paper, pencils, scissors, glue, tissues. You can see hand sanitizer. Anything that they need to help them get the education they so richly deserve, that's what we're going to give them this morning. That is amazing, Bill. Thank you for your efforts. We have a 1,000 teachers coming through here today. What districts do you help, and how do people qualify to take part because these teachers are all pre-registered from certain districts? Sure, great question. So we target the school districts that have 70% or more students on the free and reduced lunch program. So St. Louis Public Schools, Ferguson Florissant, Hazelwood, Riverview Gardens, just to say a few. Mm -hmm. And actually the districts that we serve are mostly over 90% on that free and reduced lunch program. Okay, I want to go big picture with you here quickly, Bill. How important is this program to helping teachers and students succeed in the classroom as we head back to school. This is a big deal. It's really the difference, Chris, between them being able to succeed and not. I know most of us can't even imagine our kids going to school without basic school supplies, but could you imagine not being able to have a pencil or paper to write down, learn your alphabet, do the basic things you need to get that education? And the one thing I really love about this organization is I tell people all the time, this is not a handout organization. This is a hand up. These kids want to learn. They want to succeed. They want to grow up and be baseball players and policemen, and most of them want to be teachers. What's that tell you about the influence they're making on the lives of these young students? Absolutely. Bill Adams with this point. Bill, thank you very much. No, and thank you, thank for, you, you for being here again. We appreciate Absolutely. it. Absolutely. We're going to be out here for 8 and 8.30. We're going to bring you more live shots throughout the morning. And then when these teachers start coming down Clark Street here, we'll give you some of those images as well. So, Blair and John, quite an effort out here this morning from KidSmart. They do this every year. It's really the kind of kick off the back to school for so many of these teachers to get prepared. For now, live downtown. Chris, Renee, Fox News. Yeah, every little bit helps. Thanks, Chris.